Is this messy? Yes. That's why you have to muck out their boxes. Oh, Scruffy, get away. I haven't got any peppermints today. Oh, Scruffy. Ah! Oh. <laughs> Look what you're sitting in. <laughs> oh, yuck. <laughs> you want to teach little and some manners? Before he gets too old to learn. <laughs> Hello there, boy. <laughs> How's my old Molly then? How do you know how old they are? Well, you tells an horse his age from his teeth. Come here, boy. Huh? Smaller and whiter they are, like Scruffy's here, younger the horses. What about Molly? Old horses have long yellow choppers. Yuck! But we don't know when their birthdays are, because we don't know when they were born. All ponies have their official birthday on May the 1st. May the 1st? That's today! Hey, let's give them a party! <laughs> oh, you better see your mum about that. <laughs> and I'm off to work. Mrs H.M.'s got some sort of giant cactus coming. Hmm. Scrumptious. <laughs> oh, they'll love this. Now, just a bit more bran. Ah, oh, these birthday cakes are going to be so yummy. Now, lots and lots of carrots. I hope you're not making too much mess in there, Baz. Don't worry, Mum. We'll tidy up. Oh, Thomas, uh, put lots and lots of ketchup on their sandwiches. <laughs> Well, I will if I can get it to come out. Or just give it a good whack. Hey! Whoops! <laughs> what, what, what did... Waste the... not, want not. Whoa! Wipe out! Do be careful with my provisions, Higgins. Yeah. Oh, touch of surface back. Uh, fire, Will. Just dropping off Cat's order on my way to town. Afternoon, Mrs. Horace Morris. While you're there, Mr. Watkins, perhaps you'd be good enough to pick up a couple of tins of paint. I've noticed the declining state of those farm sheds. Can't have you lowering the value of my property for the want of a coat of paint. Oh, she's a bit prickly today. <laughs> no scruffy food later. Don't spoil your appetite. <laughs> Leave Molly's hat alone. <laughs> Everyone ready? Yes. Oh, sir. Yes, ma'am. Then let's party. <laughs> I'm going to call you Freddy. I've always wanted a cactus called Freddy. Let's play musical chairs with them. Ponies don't sit on chairs. Oh, really, Buzz? <laughs> uh, sounds like they're enjoying themselves all right. <laughs> yeah, uh. Uh, help! Heavens, woman! Help! I'm 
big attack. Keep your hands on the wheel. Oh, they're shooting at me. Oh, oh be quiet. <sighs> Freddy, did those balloons frighten you? Of course, you're going to need some help. Yeah, yeah, that's just you. I, I, I could use some assistance. Now you've each got your own birthday cake, so no squabbling. Oh, Scruffy. <laughs> okay, everybody, time to sing. One, two, three. <gasps> Do you realize what those balloons have done? I have a very... I hate to ruin the pony's birthday party. But Mrs. Morris's car is stuck in the ditch, and um, she needs a pull. Well, of course we'd like to help, but uh, Will has the Land Rover, and the tractor's not working. I have a very valuable cactus which cannot be left out in the British weather. What about the ponies? For once they could be of help. Oh, them ponies could do it. Mum, it's their birthday party. They haven't even had their cake yet. We have to help if we can. Oh, I suppose so. Oh. We'll do it. Now, pass this rope through his head collar. Ah. And we're all set. You know what to do, Baz? Yes, Jim. Please, hurry. This traumatic episode is very bad for Freddy. You'll be wanting to be up on the road, Mrs. Morris. Absolutely not. If those ponies are up there, I'm staying down here. Oh, have it your way. Now, boys, heave! Come on. Come on, Scruffs. Pull, Dylan. Oh, that's it, Dylan. Pull! Doing it. Put your foot down, man. Uh, whatever you say, Mrs. Morris. That does it! Clean and neat! Look at me! Just look at me! This is cashmere! Oh, Mum! Scruffy's head collar, it's ruined! Jim, drive me home at once. <sighs> well, thank you, Jim, for your assistance. Hmm. You shouldn't be thanking me. You should be thanking Baz. That girl was having a party for them ponies, and they stopped everything to help you out. Everything! What nonsense! A party for ponies? Ha! Huh. <laughs> a bit of paint should keep Mrs. Morris happy. Mrs. Horace Morris didn't even say thank you. What does she want now? Did you want to see my dad? Don't bother your parents, Beatrice. I just need some help with this parcel. Unwrap it, please. Oh, what have you got there, Baz? Dad, it's horse things. A new dandy brush and... Oh, a head collar! If those ponies are going to live on my property, they must have proper accessories. Oh, thank you, Mrs. Morris. Uh, yes, well... <laughs> oh, my goodness. What is that creature up to now? Oh, don't worry about him. He's just helping me out. He wants to make your property look nice. Oh, uh, very good. Uh, carry on. <laughs> With the Star Hill ponies, you can never be lonely. Someone we know will help you out.